everyone, this is Stan. I'm a developer with JBS International, and I'm here with Brian Hirsch and Brock Boland. And uh, guys, tell tell us what you're doing. So, uh, Learn Drupal is a project aiming to make it easier for people to learn about and contribute to Drupal. And so, uh, it's based on a pilot project that we did in Boston over six months, uh, trying out various activities and developing materials working on um, coming up with ways to get people to um, take steps to learn Drupal or get involved in the issue queue contributing to Drupal during their user group meetups. There are meetups all around the world and if people took, you know, an hour or two hour for every, you know, for a couple meetups during the year, it could make a really big impact for the project. So, how can people get involved in contributing to Drupal? Like, say, someone like me who is a site builder. How could I get, how could I get involved? That's such a great question. And uh, so we have been trying to get other user groups outside of Boston involved in this initiative. Uh, we saw over the last six months tons of people in Boston. Um, I guess I shouldn't say tons. Uh, we saw lots of people in Boston uh, you know, contribute their first patch, make their first comment in the issue queue, contributing to core issues through this project. And now we're trying to get other user groups involved. And Brock is uh, bringing this to three different user groups in yes. the DC metro area. Yes, we're getting started with three learning sprints in the DC area. We thought that we would do one in DC, one in Virginia, and one in Maryland, so that people from all over the region would be able to attend at least one of them. Uh, that way we can get as many people involved as possible. So we have these three first sprints set up over the next six weeks, and we're hoping that we'll get a really great turnout of people who are interested in getting involved. So what would you say to companies who would want to try and you know, devote a little bit of time, their staff time, to contributing to Drupal? Like, could you talk to like perhaps a, um, an example of a company that has had success uh, in contributing to Drupal? Sure, I can give three great examples. Okay. So one really easy example is a great company that I just got acquainted with here in Washington, D.C., Appco and they are making space in their office available for meetups, for learn sprints, for issue sprints. Uh, they're welcoming the community into their office after hours to you know, get involved and uh, work with each other. So that is a wonderful help. And there's a vibrant community here in DC, you know, in, in no small part because of you know, generous organizations like that, cultivating the community and helping people find space to, to work on things. Uh, there's a, a company uh, called My Planet, uh, My Planet Digital, and they just started doing this thing where they set aside two hours every Tuesday and Thursday for their employees to contribute to Drupal, to work on Drupal Core. Um, some people are getting involved in the Learn Drupal initiative, doing issue sprints. Some people are just working on taking stuff they've been doing for their customers and contributing it uh, as contrib pro projects or getting it packaged up in pack patches to the core project. Um, something that Acquia does, um, one of uh, my like, favorite perks working at Acquia in engineering, um, has been gardening days. So the idea is that engineers' lives sort of revolve around these three-week sprints, and for one or two days of every three-week sprint, Acquia gives their engineers a day to contribute to the project. So all of those, I think, are great models for getting involved and supporting people um, getting involved in the community. Although it's worth noting, you can even start smaller. I mean, my company has um, allowed devs to spend that hour or two on Wednesdays to do the core mentoring in IRC. I mean, it's not a huge amount of time, it's not a huge commitment, but we're getting people involved in a little, little bit. You gotta start somewhere. Yeah, <laughs> yeah definitely. definitely. Okay, well, do you guys have anything else that you wanted to add? I just hope a lot of people will come and help out at the sprints, get more people involved in Drupal core development. It'll be good for everybody. That's right, and you guys have events coming up in the Drupal Yes, community? we will be posting them on the Learn Drupal group on groups.drupal.org slash learn-drupal. Uh, we have several events posted up there. The first one's coming up next Tuesday, April 17th, in Alexandria at the Phase 2 office. You can find the information all there. And I guess if you see this after those dates, you can also get involved at learndrupal.org or by just joining the group on groups.drupal.org slash learn-drupal. Uh, plug you in there. All right, well, thanks a lot, guys, and thank you for watching.